How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you today as always. Just gonna do a little update for you guys on where I'm at in the battle pass because I did get some new items and they are so epic. So I did get the Roar of the Order UI theme and I do have it equipped I believe. Yes, I do have it equipped so you guys can see what that looks like. Actually, the avatar I kind of want to change. Let's do uh, something old school. How about the beta avatar? You probably don't see that one too too often. So, I also got High Priestess Nye. One of the few awesome new skins that you get in this battle pass. Those are the weapons that you get with it as well that can be used on any other legend that uses spear or katars. But this video is going to be dedicated completely to High Priestess Nye. So we're going to be playing some games with her. And, you know, it's been a long time. Let's do some uh, 1v1. It's been a long time since I've really dedicated a video to Queen Nye, probably. Uh, but she has some really cool uh, skins. And as you can see, I do have Code of Lions colors. But I also have a lot of other colors. So here is High Priestess Nye. Let's take a look at it with classic colors and then all the others. And I gotta say, they look really good in my opinion. Community colors could have looked better. Coat of Lions, beautiful. Pretty much all the colors that you would normally think would look good do look good, and some even look better than expected, in my opinion. Like uh, Gala, I really like that. I'm probably not going to be able to uh, play every single color in this video, so I'm just going to pick my favorite colors. And let's see. After we actually, gray doesn't look bad. Some of these, like, you know, lower level colors or whatever, actually do not look that bad. Uh, I think I'll play the first game with Co of Lions. And yes, I usually do speed stance with Queen Nye. That's just me. Uh, I really like faster legends. I'm not really one for slow legends, so that's why I put the speed up. All right, here we go. If you guys enjoy the Brawlhalla content, be sure to hit that like button. I really appreciate it. All right, here we go against Mick Bob, playing as a Jay Yun, which is cool. I haven't really seen too many Jay Yun players. And to be honest, I never really see a Queen Nye player either. Queen Nye, you know, like way, way, way back when Brahalla was a new game, when I first got uh, into it, Queen Nye was actually a pretty popular legend. And I don't think she is anymore. I mean, I think she's actually one of the least played. But, I don't know if it's because she's like a bad legend or if it's just because she's so slow. You know, I think she's not that bad of a legend. I think it's just because she's so dang slow. But, you know, also, I would say that Queen Nye is probably... And these are all just my opinions. You guys know that. Uh, but I think Queen Nye is actually better as a 2v2 or free-for-all type of legend. Basically, any kind of game mode where there's lots of people. Because those are the modes that you're going to hit these signatures, like, easily. Ooh, wow, I'm surprised that hit me, but okay. In 1v1, the slowness really, like, can get you in trouble. If you miss one signature, you usually get punished hard for it. As you guys saw. But I'm still doing alright. Look at that, neutral sig on Jayon is just so good. I gotta <laughs> try to avoid that when I'm in red, but it comes out like literally instantly. You can't even like punish it, I feel like. Whoa, okay, don't ask me how I got away with that, but it worked. Ooh, got him right there. All right, well, we got a pretty clean one stock, actually very clean one stock lead here. My life will be complete if I can hit a... Okay, I hit it. I was going to say a neutral sig on Queen Nye. Feels better if you can actually hit it for a uh, KO, though. I'll try to get the K uh, KO with the neutral sig, but at the same time, I do need side sig KOs. So I might just try to get... There it is. <laughs> I'll get that side sig. It feels so good when you hit the side sig with Katars on Queen Nye, though. Like, it has so much power. That's the one fun thing about Queen Nye. Wait, I thought I needed side sig! Oh, I do, I do. Okay, I got one. I need five more. I also need unarmed KOs, grounded light attacks, wind matches, legends with bot in their name, but I can't with Queen Nye. Gravity canceling emo at the end of matches. Okay, I keep forgetting all of that. Alright, so let's do a different color this time. Ooh, Frozen Forest does look really good. 
Let's do charged OG. I know this is a fan favorite, so you guys can see what it looks like. I guess I'll keep the weapons the same, uh, just because they go so well with the skin. Maybe on the last game, I'll change up the weapons for you guys to something, something a little bit more spicy. All right, ooh, what a cool name, Moonwalker. He's a veteran of Asgard 5, which means he's been playing Brahalla for five years. That's a long time. I think that's the same as me. And Moonwalker is playing Caspian, the uh, the Halloween Caspian, Immortal Caspian, is that what it's called? All right, this stage I do not like. It's gonna be rough, guys. I don't like this stage at all. Too many platforms and gauntlets are really easy to get around all those platforms. Basically, I have to hope that Moonwalker here makes a mistake because it's going to be so easy for him to punish me every time I do. Oh my goodness, Moonwalker's going on fire here. It's actually not that bad. We can still... Okay, bro. <laughs> He's getting... He really wants that neutral sig. How epic would it be if I could hit with a neutral sig? Oh, we got that down sig though. He's gonna try to hit me, I know he is. So sigs are, oh, we got the neutral sig KO, let's go. I'm actually so scared of Moonwalker, he is so good. Caspian, I feel like is just a vastly better legend than Queen Eye, but it's all in how you play the legend, right? Oh my goodness, see what I mean? I did not play well right there. And gauntlets, oh man, they're just so OP on uh, off stage. Like, neutral sig is gonna save me so much on this map. How did I not hit that side air? Come on, BMG. Oh, that side sig, let's go. I need five more. I think I got one or two, maybe only one on this uh, fight so far, so. We're going to this side because he is too scary over there. Bro, side six, so strong! Oh my gosh, I was so scared of Moonwalker the whole game, but those six are just too strong. GG, dude, GG. Well played. I, I was scared of the map, too. Like, I don't like that map, but... The way that I get around it, basically, is by avoiding the platforms and just staying in the middle of the map. <laughs> Let them come to you. Alright, let's do a different color. I think that we should do black at least once, but I feel bad I don't have Skyforged or Goldforged. Let's go into training so we can see what those look like. I really want to see the Skyforge and Goldforge on this skin. All right, there's Skyforge. It actually doesn't look that cool. You can barely even tell it's Skyforge. Goldforge looks better, but it's actually not as cool as I thought it would be. Okay, so not a big deal. It's, it's not bad. Goldforge and Skyforge usually look amazing though. Um, let's do black. Gonna go ble uh, speed stance again. All right. Let me know, guys, down below or in the chat, if you are a Queen Nye main. I'm assuming if you're watching the video, you're either interested in v Queen Nye or you just like to watch the videos, but probably gonna attract some Queen Nye mains into this video, right? Let me know if you are, because you're a rare species in, indeed. We did the same move, basically. That's funny, dude.
dude. These blasters are gonna be the end of me! No! I forgot about Reno Side 6 being so dang good. Oh my gosh, that was... That was death. Oh, we got the side sig and the first stock. Let's go. I think I need a lot more side sigs. I forgot to look after the last game, so... Whoa, he went through my weapon throw. I thought that would stop him. All right. He pretty much evened it back up. Ooh. There we go. Got that neutral sig again? Not quite. His dodging is good. I'll say that. Ooh, there we go. There we go. Don't know why I did that. Don't know. Oh, he could have done so much better. That's okay. Okay, he didn't dodge that one. Sometimes he, he goes through my weapon throws, I feel like. Oh, dude! He, uh, <laughs> he grabbed the bomb so he could take the side stick in the face. Okay, and then it, it came full circle. I took the bomb in the face. It's okay. We got the stock. Nice little... Oh, my. The speed on Reno's side sig. Maybe I can get another side stick here. Nope. Like, you can call Queen Knight a six spammer because she pretty much has to be, to be a good legend. But at the same time, it leaves me wide open when I do a six. So like, if I'm winning and, and I'm throwing out a lot of six, like, and I'm missing a lot of the time. Those are punishable, for sure. Uh, but GG do GG. I'm gonna do one more game, guys. Last game. This time I will mix up the weapons and stuff. I think I'll go home team colors because we are in the back to school event. For the spear, let's go ahead and give her something really epic looking. I'm thinking either the spear from the Aurora Brin or something else that's animated. Um, I do have a lot of good choices here as you can see there's so many good weapons in this game This one's pretty cool. Let's do sealed glory. I guess it's not quite the same as Aurora Brin spear But it's still pretty cool and for Katars mm, Do we even uh, have any animated Katars other than the serpent's fangs? I don't remember. I don't think so. So we might just use serpent fangs Yeah, let's use serpent fangs. They're the only animated Katars in the game right now, so uh, yeah, well, well, I do like her default guitars though. They do look awesome. Did I pass? Okay, Serpent Fangs. Ooh, look at that, like, golden and black. Oh, that looks so cool. I do like these colors. Usually, Home Team has a little bit of the, uh, the reddish, like, maroon or whatever, but I don't see any of that on this skin right now. Alright, going against x Mirga, Playing as Mirage. First, uh, Scythe Legend we went against today, right? I pretty much can't make a video without going against Scythe Legend. Scythe Legends are the most popular, and I like Scythe a lot too. I didn't at first, but it grew on me quite a bit. Alright bro, I let you get weapon, you don't want to let me, it's fine. I see how it is. She going all out. Even got the accidental taunt. Oh, she tried ground pound on me. See, look at that. All that work at the beginning of the match where I let her get weapon and then she punched me in the face and she still got her stock lost. You know why? 
bad karma. No, I'm just joking. I don't really care that much. It is kind of rude in my opinion, but you know, if they if that's what they want to do, that's fine. Oh my goodness. That was actually pretty crazy, not gonna lie. Ooh, nice weapon throw. All right, she got unarmed KO. That's actually one that I need to get. I need two or three more unarmed, I think. Bye-bye. All right, that doesn't count as an unarmed. Still weapon throw, but GG dude, GG. Well played. Yeah, I didn't get any progress on missions right there. All right, guys. Well, I think we won every single game with Queen Nye. That's actually surprising to me. I'm, I really don't consider myself Queen Nye main, but I, apparently we still got some game. <laughs> uh, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please drop a like. really helps the channel out, and I greatly appreciate it. And uh, yeah, be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content. I'm always putting it out there. Let's look real, cl uh, real quickly what's coming up in the battle pass. So I have the scythe. Ooh, all right, all right. We got the scythe coming up. The guitars. We got this uh, bonfire emo. We got the uh, KO knock knockout effect. <laughs> all right, so we got a lot coming up. As always, guys, this is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, friends.